what is my allele burden? What is my allele burden? Let me explain it in the best way that I understand it. The very, I'm not a scientist, but I'm trying my way of explaining. So on the Facebook groups, I've seen so many people post about their allele burden. Now this is, I've been on it for a couple of years now, right? Um, and I'm kind of referring back to when it was first going on, everyone's like, oh, my allele burden's this or that or this or that. And I just left it and then I thought, you know, I should ask my doctor, what is my allele burden? So I have been tested twice, two times, actually now three times uh, for the JAK2 mutation. The first one, for some reason, it didn't show up in my doctor's records. So when I transferred, this doctor is like, um, I can't find your JAK2 test anywhere. And I'm like, oh no. She's like, we're gonna test again. So they test again, positive, right? Then I got my bone marrow biopsy and we already have the JAK2 test, positive, whatnot. And then of course it comes back positive for the mutation there also. So three times, I think it's kind of, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's justified um, to say that I distinctly have that mutation. So when they do the mutation, usually they will have essentially a percentage of how much of your gene um, is the variation of that is the mutation. So I'll just kind of go over this really quickly. When I did my first um, test, they tested positive, got zero um, information more than that. And this was during a crazy time anyhow when I was pregnant and just, I didn't understand to even look at my test. I wasn't really into all that right then. Then um, the second test that I got, um, it just said positive and it went on some long blurb of scientific research of why it's positive, but it gave zero percentages. It didn't do anything where I could know what my alle allele burden was. So my third Jack 2 uh, mutation test was for my bone marrow biopsy and that came back and it said yes she has this it went on some scientific explanation again and also said there is a 55 percent uh, burden i'll get the exact wording for you in a minute and essentially that percentage is how much of your gene because we all have genes right is is um kind of um how should i say this Okay, to explain alleles is essentially we have our DNA. We get half from our mom, half from our dad. And with that, we will get our different sequencing. With that, we have genes. The genes would be uh, eyes, nose, mouth, hands, hair, yada, yada, right? With that, we have different distinguishing things with our skin, with our eyes, with our hair. So one of my alleles would be um, whatever describing the gene or it's a variant of the gene. So I have the gene to have hair and then that variant from there goes down to say blonde hair. She's born with, I was born with white hair but now it's darker but blonde hair, right? So it's the variant on your gene. Then with that, we're gonna relate it to the Jack 2 information. So everybody has that Jack 2 it's part of our makeup, right? With that, we are looking at our, um, the Jack 2, oh goodness, I forgot the name, poop, poop, poop. It's a uh, X-Men have it. I always relate it to, hold on, I gotta look it up. It's the mutation, the mutation. So with that, this mutation in particular, again on here it says, a missense variant in Jack 2, which we all have, at amino acid 617, converting the wild type residue valine to phenylalanine. <laughs> I don't understand that. Anyway, um, it says for a variant all allele frequency VAF of 55%. So essentially I have the gene and then with that, there is an allele that has been, it's a different type of that Jack 2 and that has been to the wild one and it's 55% of the burden. So 
They say a burden of 50 or more. Oh goodness, do I even want to go here? I don't. So all in all, I hope you're able to understand that the allele is the variation um, or is the percentage of the gene variation. Essentially, a burden of 50 or more is really poopy and I'll get all sciencey on you later. Right now I'm a little emo when I come to it. Like, I don't even want to talk about that right now. I've got so many things I'm trying to do. I hope this helped you with your allele burden, kind of understanding it's the percentage of the variant on your gene. <laughs>